Good day, everybody. We have some huge news in the Genshin world. Um, MiHoYo dropped some big changes on us a few hours ago, starting with our guest character appearance, Alloy from Horizon Zero Dawn. Basically, um, Genshin, MiHoYo, the whole team there decided to give us a free new five-star character, ladies and gentlemen. Alloy, this is fantastic news. Um, I'm very excited for her. Um, they're also going to be giving us a bow as well. MiHoYo really decided to drop this news on us before the leakers could. Um, and PlayStation players will be able to obtain her in patch 2.1. She will be available to everyone else in 2.2. But here's what this means for Genshin Impact's future. They could potentially do more collabs with Sony and even anime shows if they tried, if they wanted to. And if this, if um, we get Genshin Impact on Xbox as well, that could also mean some more exclusive characters coming out. That is insane news. I'm really excited for that. Um, and it's really funny because I actually talked to my girlfriend about um, Alloy and Kratos and Atreus from God of War being on the table now ever since they got um, PlayStation accounts like linking with um, PC so like I don't know there, there's just like so much that's on the table now and that's really exciting okay okay so let's kind of go over this um, this art for alloy this is actually fantastic news here so what we know is she will be a cryo Oh, user. I, I immediately just jumped out of bed just to like kind of go over this content here because this is this is huge and since we're getting patched like maybe the beta sometime very soon in like the next few days here um they MiHoYo decided to basically just leak leak these characters way before uh, other leakers could get it because it's just so much content it's fantastic news so enough about that one, um, we also got some potential banner art released as well. So let's go over that, starting with the Raiden Shogun Ball. Her Excellency seeks to rid herself of the mundane delusions of the world, but only in an attempt to overcome the cycle of life and death, Kitsune Sagi. So here is her artwork. Um, this is crazy because um, what this suggests, what this highly suggests and implies is that she's going to be coming out in patch 2.1. Getting her character art this early is crazy because um, we, I don't know, this, this means that she could be coming out sooner than we all thought. We also have, we also have Sarah, Crowfeather, Kabu Raya. Um, General of the Tenryo Commission, leader of the Tenryo Commission's forces, bold, decisive, and skilled in battle. Now this is crazy too, meaning that um, it's well, we this is already three characters that we could be getting in patch 2.1. Actually, actually, Alloy is confirmed, but we don't know about these characters just yet. And we also have Komi. This is crazy too, so we could be getting up to 4 characters in patch 2.1 and it's not the characters that I expected to be out this soon. I honestly thought we were going to just be getting some scraps, um, just one 5 star character in one banner and then one 4 star character in the second banner. I, I think MiHoYo is not going to go that route. I strongly believe that these 4 characters are all going to be coming out in patch 2.1. Ball is coming way sooner than I thought. And while well, that is really fantastic news for the Genshin community, I'm mostly excited for Alloy because she's she's just a really, really cool character, and especially in her own game. So the potential that we could be getting more crossovers like this if she does well means that there's like just high hopes for maybe even Kratos from God of War. Um, and then if we even start like collabing with Xbox as well, that could mean other things down the road. We've already done collaborations with KFC, so literally nothing is off the table as like uh, we get like wings for characters or characters or weapons or anything of that matter. Um, Genshin Impact will collab with anybody that is willing to collab with them and that's fantastic news. This game is huge. 
everybody would be crazy not to do it i'm looking forward to the future um let me know what you guys who you guys think will be uh potential characters in the game potential weapons what do you think they're going to be doing collabs with down the road um i want to know um let's let's talk about it all right thank you guys